Woodworker... <laughs> Woodworkers, please stop what you're doing and follow me. It's time for the skills challenge. I know you love it. Follow, follow. Their second weekly challenge tests the woodworkers on a key technique, whatever the weather. Woodworkers, I feel like we've come away on a Scouts and Brownies outdoor adventure weekend. Dib, dib. Alex and Helen will reveal what today's skills challenge is going to be. You must whittle as many teaspoons as possible within the challenge time. They can be of any design, but they must be identical and they must be well finished. OK, you've got 90 minutes on this challenge, hood workers. So get whittling. Whittling is an ancient art, turning a piece of wood into an object just using hand tools. This is one of the very first things that I can imagine mankind would have done. The earliest existing examples in Europe date back over 6,000 years. I'll just do it more by eye, I think. My tactic is to leave them as rectangles. <laughs> Done two spoons. Charlie, mm. how many are you done? Six. I'm going to do another as quick as possible. Because put your whittling equipment down. The skills challenge is over. Tools down, please, Jade. Thanking you. If you win this, you get that valuable immunity from the double elimination this week. This is a really important one, OK? The woodworkers have whittled as many spoons as they could in 90 minutes. OK, woodworkers, it is now time for judges Helen and Alex to have a look at your whittling work. Whoever the judges choose to win will escape this week's double elimination. One, two, three. They're similar size, and the handles are quite similar. They're a bit like wooden spoons for stirring. They're scaled down, aren't they? It's good effort. Thank you.